Hey, welcome back to the Beer Bench. This is Mikey from the Perfect Pour Podcast. This time out, we're using my Beer Bench, and we are trying Juicy Central Coast Barrel House. They're in the Paso Robles, not the very far from Firestone. Or should I say Firestone is not very far from Barrel House. Juicy. So I'm going to assume it's New England foggy style IPA. It's just fun to say juicy because of Scotty B. If you listen to the show, you know why that's fun. It's just fun. Here are the stats. I, I like these new style. Tauga really one of the first I saw, but this new style of uh, labels give you all the info in a snazzy way. So here we go. It's my first time. This was a looking out for beer. And, uh, well, hmm. Should we do a, I'm going to try. I don't think this is going to work. But, uh, I'm going to use my old cutter from my grocery store days. We used to work at Bonds. And, uh, let's see if I can figure out how to open a beer with that cutter. There's a blade in there. Probably should watch out. Not going well. I would have tested it out, but then that would. What, what fun would that be? <laughs> Why must I always embarrass myself? All right, that's not fucking working. We're just going to do this because I'm getting really thirsty at this point. <laughs> Almost in the glass. I really like this glass. Oh, Matt. Got these for us, I think. Pretty sure. I'm gonna assume. I think they're like kind of like festival glasses, cause look, it's got the uh, six ounce pour limit there. Doesn't maybe it's not New England style. I was just I'm so so freaking. Everything's just so New England style now. You just hear juicy. It's going to be like a foggy IPA, but it's not. It's just a fruity IPA. I assume now. Now we're pulling back. What the hell? What the hell is going on? No, it's, it's New England style. Huh. That is the clearest New England style I've ever seen. Interesting. Cheers. Hmm. That is a super clean New England style. I would have, if you wouldn't have told me New England style, I would not have, I would not have thought that. Hmm. Interesting. It's good though. The mango is not mango. I'm thinking they have another one mango, don't they? It's the, the fruitiness isn't overpowering at all. But it's there. Everything's, you know. Everything's kind of chill, which is fine. It's it's good though. I'm gonna recommend it, especially for any beer, good beer bench. I'll recommend it. Good try once. I think it was, I think it was a seven dollar bottle that Fig Tree liquor here. I think most a lot of places in Central California, especially, I think I've seen it in SoCal as well, getting Barrel House. They're good, good. They got a cool tap room too. If you ever go to Firestone, make sure to check out Bear House as well, and check out the Perfect Four on all your podcast internet boxes. Thanks for uh, joining me on another beer bench. Cheers.